Here's next I learned, communication, how to conduct a meeting. I learned identification, logic and reason, attack and confess, solution. Simple deals on communication. Wasn't easy for me at first. I stood up to give my first presentation, my mind sat back down, <laughs> right? Y'all been through that? Opened my mouth, nothing came out for a while. But here's what I did, I did it again. Just jot that phrase down, I did it again. That's the secret to how I got here. 35, 40 years later, it's how I got here. I did it once, it was uncomfortable. That first presentation was so lousy, if I hadn't have been doing it, I'd have gone home. <laughs> it was not that good. But here's the secret to how I got here. I did it again, and then I did it again, and then I did it again, and I did it again. I remember when I first decided to be a little more animated, right? And walk out away from the podium, right? Get out from just behind the podium. So I got out there, and then I thought, how do you get back? <laughs> Whoa, I'm stranded out here. Remember those times, doing something for the first time? But you learn quickly in your business, right? In your business, a guy stands up to give his first testimonial, and he's so nervous, he forgets his own name, right? And 30 days later, he wants to give a three-hour testimonial, right? You hardly get him off the stage. So, learn communication. How to affect other people with words. That's the greatest art in the world to learn, how to affect other people with words. Key phrase, don't be lazy in language. If you learn to use the gift of your own language wisely, it can make you a fortune and build an incredible life. Here's three other things I learned. One is to train, training people how the business works. And then I've used another word called teach, train and teach. And only to say this, training people how the business works, teaching is how life works. Because here's what all of us need for the 21st century, business skills and life skills. The life skills are leadership skills. The life skills are learning how to set goals. Now here's the ultimate skill to learn that can transform your life and the life of whoever will listen. The ability to inspire. Inspire means help people to look up a little higher than where they are and wish they could get there and inspire them that it's possible. Here's how we inspire, by our own testimonial. If I can do it, you can do it. Here's how else we inspire, by others' testimonial. If they can do it, Mary, you can do it. Getting people to see themselves better than they are. Getting people to see themselves richer than they are. Getting people to see themselves more capable next year than they are this year. Getting to see themselves in the future. To help both your kids and your people, here's what you must learn to do. Number one, help people to see themselves as they are. If people have made mistakes, they gotta know it. You can't go on making mistakes and hope to achieve. Mistakes have to be corrected. And you've got to do it with your children, help them to see themselves as they are. If they've messed up, here's what you've got to say. You've messed up. But here's what's important as a parent, don't leave them in the mess. Some parents, you know, tell their kids they've messed up and then they leave them in the mess. They don't paint a better picture. Here's what you could become with just a couple of more changes. Rather than this, here's what you could be. So we must help our children see themselves as they are, but here's the greatest gift, to help our children see themselves better than they are. To transport them not only past to see their mistakes, but transport them to the future to see their opportunity. To see the person they can become. My mentor had that greatest gift to help me to see myself better than I was. At first it was difficult to see, and then I started to believe, and that's how I got here today. He said, one of these days, Mr. Owen, you'll walk into a room full of people, and you will hear some of them say, that's him, that's the famous man. I, I said, well, that could never happen to me. He said, trust me. If you keep working hard on the disciplines like you're doing right now, that'll happen. You'll walk into a room full of people, and you'll hear one say, that's him, that's the famous man. He saw it, and he tried to get me to see it. And now, finally, it's happened. I think when I walked in here today, I think I heard someone say, that's him, that's the famous man. <laughs> it happened for me. And if it can happen for me, it can happen for you. Just master these skills to inspire.